What is going on everyone? Today we're going to be watching and reacting to the first Omen, which of course released this year in 2024. I have seen the original Omen from 1976. I did a reaction to it on this channel. Didn't watch any of the other Omen movies just yet, but I've heard a lot of good things about this. I know this is a prequel to the original Omen. I'm not really exactly sure how it's a prequel, like in what way is it a prequel? What questions will it be answering about that original film? But I did like that original movie quite a bit. Like I said, if you want to see the reaction, the link will be in the description to that reaction. But uh, like I said, heard good things about this one. So let's check it out. Haven't really seen any clips from it, so I'm not really sure what it's going to be like. But I really wanted to see it before the end of the year. If you want to see the full cut reaction, that'll be my Patreon the links. That'll be it in the description down below. And don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Let's watch. It's interesting, too, because I'm currently watching American Horror Story Season 8, and that season is all about the Antichrist. And I know, obviously, the Omen's about the Antichrist as well. That's what Damien was. Oh, it's uh, Ralph In Incent or something like that? I, I know this actor. I forget his name, though. That's all I have. The only proof of what they've done. But she looks so human. Don't let yourself be fooled. She wasn't conceived naturally. Just like Damien wasn't conceived naturally? They found a volunteer, someone devoted. But how did they? No, please, I can't talk about that. What the hell? What I can tell you is that the pregnancy happened quickly. They're just waiting until she's old enough. Old enough for what? I can't do this anymore. I can't do this anymore. I can't. Please don't let it touch me again. What the fuck? Hiding won't absolve your sins. You think I want to be forgiven? Oh, I just realized it's Tywin Lannister. <laughs> What's the actor's name? Oh man, I'm t one of these things are gonna fall on one of them. It's gonna happen. I'm it's gonna it's gonna fall. They were focusing on it for a reason. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. It's all in slow-mo now. Oh Oh shit. Those are some big shards of glass. Oh, I guarantee you a big chunk went right in him. It's in the back of the head, isn't it? It's... No? I'm, t I'm telling you, man. There's no way it didn't hit him in the back of the head. Oh! Holy crap. What the fuck? <laughs> That's one hell of an opening. So yeah, Father Brennan, that was one of the characters in the in the first film. Okay, I remember that now. The state has contracted with us to take in many unmarried women who are about to give birth. We have our birthing facilities here in the hospital wing. What is this like the 1960s? Something like that? She grew okay. up Okay. Abandoned on our front steps. I'm assuming she doesn't speak a lot. Um, Ave Maria is my favorite too. Como te chiami? I'm Margaret. Me chiami Margaret. I don't think this kid is great at interactions. What the hell? Why are you crawling up to her like that? Um. Whoa! What are you doing? Get off of me! What the hell? Yeah, there's something something off with her, clearly. Have you been behaving yourself, Carlita? Carlita. Clearly not. Lord, speak to every human heart and fill it with the conviction. I am wanted. I have a task in history. I am accepted and I am loved. It is good that I have said. The fuck? I mean, this is a horror movie, so there's going to be some scary shit going down for sure. Ah, Margaret's one of our worst behaved children. What if she has another episode? What the fuck? Then you must tie her to the bed. Ah! Oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Mierda. 
You must be Margareta. Yes. I'm Lucy. Oh. <laughs> so how does a girl from... Pittsfield, Massachusetts. So how does a girl from Peacefield end up in Italy <laughs> about to take the veil? Peacefield. Well, Cardinal Lawrence was, um, was a priest at the orphanage that I grew up in. And we got pretty close because, uh, well, I was somewhat of a problem child. I mean, I used to get punished a lot. And how did they punish you? <laughs> and where did you get these? Hey. Would they beat you? Would they beat me? No, not really. I used to have a pretty active imagination. I get so convinced sometimes that what I was seeing was real that the sisters would need to um, subdue me. Damn. Oh shit! Is that her seeing herself? It must. It's, it's. I think she's just having a memory. Or no, is this actually happening? Shit, I don't know. Cause she was talking about that happening to her before, so that's why I'm thinking maybe it's just like a memory that's like somehow getting into her vision. She's like seeing it happen. I I don't know. What the fuck? Oh shit. Oh you? my god. <laughs> I have something to show you for tonight. Oh my god, you look hot. I look naked. Yes. <laughs> yeah, she does not like any sort of revealing clothes whatsoever. I can't do this. Have you ever been to a bar? Why don't you switch dresses? I don't know. <laughs> They're very different dresses. To the bravest girl I know. Go. Do you still feel your heart? I'm Alfonso, and this is Paul. Oh. I miss a fat. Ah, yeah, eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Yes, eat it. <laughs> what do you What do you do? Um. Is she gonna be honest? Sono una farfalla e devo voler. Ain't no way she meant to say that. Is that what she meant to say? Se sei una farfalla, allora non ti posso impedire di volare. Why did it cut out like that? The fuck? Oh my god, it looked like her head was chopped off. <laughs> She's just under blankets. I'm assuming she hooked up with this guy. Oh. Was that sweat or blood? The fuck happened? I didn't like embarrass myself or anything last night, did I? No. You were well behaved. Mostly. <laughs> Let's just say you took my advice to hurt. You were a very brave girl, Margarita. But hey, don't worry. It's a little secret, okay? Yeah, because that would get her in trouble with the, the place she's at, right? If they found out about that. This will only take a few minutes. Your name is Margaret Taino. You work at the orphanage. I, I don't understand. How do you know that? It's about the girl, Skiana. Carlita? You must be very careful, Margaret. Oh, the little girl. Bad things will start to happen around her. Evil things. Come see me tonight. St. Rita Cloister, room 42. I'll tell you everything. Oh, shit. Where's Carlita? She's in the bad room. The fuck are they doing in the bad room? Oh, oh, oh. Sister, I need your help. Carlita, she's, she's locked in a room. That's right. She bit Sister Romano just this morning. Oh, my God. She had to go to the bad room. Why is there a bad room? Because some girls are bad. I mean, I get like a timeout sort of system, but like locking them in a room uh, seems like a bit much. And they gave her a bucket to, I'm assuming to pee in? That is fucked up. The things we do aren't always pleasant. Yeah, but this is a child though, you know? Um, but I guess who else was bad? Who? 
You? Oh, yeah. But you know what? I realize that I'm not bad. They just tell you that you are because you're not doing what they want you to do. That is fair. I mean, obviously, she shouldn't be biting people, but <laughs> locking her in a room's not going to help that. What did you do? It's good that she's actually talking to her now, though. Well, I guess at first I tried to run away. I didn't fix the feeling. That's what I like about you, actually. I think that you feel the same way that I felt. But you're not scared. You don't run away. You just you raise your little claws and you fight. <laughs> Carlita, go to your room, okay? I'll be right there. The hell is this? Someone giving birth? Oh my goodness. Oh. Was she given some sort of laughing drug, laughing gas type thing? What the fuck? God damn. Oh. Oh. What the fuck? Oh my god! What the fuck was that? <laughs> Is that the jackal thing? Because Damien was born with through a jackal, right? Something like that? I don't know. I don't know. That looked like a... That, that was scary looking. I don't know. You wouldn't be the first to faint witnessing the birth of a child. That was not a child. That was a fucking claw. <laughs> There was a there was a claw coming out. A claw. You alright? Yes. What what the fuck? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> what 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 the hell was that? Where is she? Oh please tell me she's not gonna jump. The fucking, the, oh, the one girl jumped in the first movie, you remember that? Oh my god. Oh shit. It's all for you. Why? Her? Carlita? All for her? No, no, don't, don't, don't! What the fuck? It wasn't just jumping it, lighting herself on fire and then hanging herself. Oh my god. Wow. God damn. This shot is really good looking. This whole movie is really well shot, to be honest. It's a damn good looking movie. Something happened, didn't it? Yes. One of the sisters took her own life. You mentioned the name Skiana? I assume you know these people. The priest is named Spilletto. He's a radical. Spiletto. He's from the first movie, right? Maybe in this photo is Carlito? I believe so. Oh, okay. The truth is, there are two churches. The one that follows the teachings of Christ. The one that you and I are part of. And the other. The church that will turn a blind eye to torture. To commit mm. murder in the name of God, all in the name of supreme power. What do you think that church is most frightened of? The devil? Secularism. We are we are living in unprecedented times. Look at what's been occurring in your very own generation. A culture that is unspoken, rebelling, sometimes violently. People are turning away from the church in droves. Yeah. Now how do you control people who no longer believe in your stories of fire and brimstone? People who do not seem to fear. You create something to fear. Oh sh oh my god, that's oh my god, that's actually so interesting. So is that the whole point of creating this antichrist? Yeah, I mean, this was like, it's like 1960s, 1970s, right? So like a lot of people were turning away from the church at that point, yeah. Believe they can birth the antichrist and then yeah, control Yeah, they haven't him. yet, right? Because that ends up being Damien, right? I believe the baby girl in the picture is to be the mother. The mother of, of what? Oh, the mo of the antichrist. Of the antichrist? 
So she ends up giving birth to Damien. Come on, you're crazy. Look, if I am right, Carlita would have been born on the sixth day of the sixth month at 6 a.m. 6, 6. Oh, shit, yeah, because that was that happened in the Omen as well. I, I don't understand why you're telling me this. They're keeping her files at the orphanage, locked away. It's going to happen, right? Well, so if she ends up being the mother of Damien, then this a beast. There has to be a jackal. That's the father. Yeah, the jackal. And the jack was the jackal the one that was just born? The evil inside her will do whatever it takes to stop us. We must destroy it at all costs. Can't kill a little girl, though. <laughs> and she is not pregnant. But we're not talking about a human child. We haven't a lot of time, and I need your help. I'm sorry that I can't help you. See, I, I was liking this movie, but it's getting really damn good now. Like, <laughs> I'm, I'm really invested now, now that I'm seeing the full scope of the story, where it's going to be leading. But so, yeah, the, 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 this has to be like at least 10 years before the original Omen, then, if she, that little girl's going to end up being the... Well, I guess you could get pregnant kind of young, it's possible, but I mean, I, I guess maybe. But it's got to be at least a couple years then. I said things. And... I can't tell if they're real or not. When I was younger, I I used to have these. She was kind of similar, horrible right? Horrible visions. They were so terrible that I convinced myself. They're both that they they're both very real. similar, yeah. Because she's getting locked in these rooms, and she also had the same thing happen to her because of those visions. Carlita, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The fuck? Oh! Oh my god. <laughs> there you are. <sighs> Our riot's broken out. We must go. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh, are they just kidnapping her now? Like, what the fuck? Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Oh, what the hell? You don't think that thing was actually there, right? I, again, I think that was a vision, but... Hell if I know. Is no one actually... Was no one actually on her at all? Oh my god. I'm sure this will come as no surprise, but I've become concerned. I'm fine. Perhaps I should have put it this way. We are concerned. <laughs> Myself and Cardinal Lawrence. We think it might be time for you to take a step back, and perhaps we postpone your vows. What? No, why? We're also concerned about your attachment to Carlita. You think they know deep down that she's trying to investigate this in a way that's going against them? Well, they, they did see her just then. She was like freaking out and there was no one really around her. Stop the car, Luca. Is that the guy from the other night? Paolo! Paolo! Oh, yeah. oh something really bad must have happened. He seems terrified. Paolo! Leave me alone, please. What did she do? Sorry, I didn't know. Really, I didn't know. You didn't know what? Just stop following me! Oh my god. Just look for them up. Oh! God damn! I mean, yeah, that's just like how the first movie was. People kept dying all around... All around Damien. But now it seems like it's people dying around her. <laughs> Oh my god. Um, call, call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! I'm gonna help you. I'm scared. You're gonna be fine, I promise. Holy shit. No one died. No, 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 no. He's so dead. You ready? <laughs> oh, you shouldn't have done that. Oh, it's like. Oh my god! Holy shit. Oh god. Holy god damn. 
Ugh. Oh my god, man. These, this movie's fucking crazy. Oh, that's a fantastic shot. She's gonna hopefully find these files on Carlita. What the fuck? <laughs> Damn. That is tight. I guess that's how it's supposed to be. June 6th, 6 a.m. There you go. But must be kept away from other girls. Oh shit, there it is, man. That, conf that confirms it. It has to, right? Wait, what? Infants died at childbirth. What the fuck? They tried multiple times, but most of them died in childbirth. Dude, this is actually a really interesting prequel. Like, I didn't think how... <laughs> it makes sense that this would be the, the prequel they would do to the Omen, but it's, it's pretty brilliant. Oh, shit. Oh my god. Oh, shit. I know what we you're doing. We don't want to hurt you. I know what you've done with the babies. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. 666. Six, six. <laughs> oh, they're gonna throw her in the bad room, aren't they? Damn. What the f- Dude, the imagery in this movie is so fucking good. No, I think it- I think it is real. What? Who, yeah, who the fuck said? Who the fuck is it? Who, who the fuck was that? Oh, there's gonna be someone coming out of the darkness, isn't there? Oh, what the fuck? What is what is she covered in? Oh my god! Oh, it's the girl from before. Her face is all fucked. Oh my god. Wait, she's all burnt up because of the fire. Yeah, these are visions, but oh, they're like, I don't, I don't know, man. They're like spiritual visions, though. They're, they're not like, she's not like mentally insane. They're not mental issues. It's, I, I literally think it's just all related to spiritual stuff. I don't know. It's a good thing Father Gabriel seems to be on her side. He's aware something's up. Oh, well done, Mary. Well done. <laughs> Were you followed? What? No. I don't think so. Luca, Marcus, driver, brought us. We can trust him. He's keeping watch outside. Carlita, we have to go get him. No, it's not safe. Not safe? She's the one who's not safe right now. Okay. Margaret, after what just happened, they're not gonna let us anywhere near that orphanage. There's so many of them. Yes. Oh my god. Stillborn? They need a man. Oh, there you go. That's why. They believe the only way is for the beast to mate with his own offspring. Oh god. What is this? I told you it's a photo from Carlita's birth. No. 
this? It's what are we looking at? Carlita doesn't have the mark on her head. Oh, so that's not Carlita? Hers is here. Find the baby with the mark on its scalp. Well, a lot of them are dead, though. So if you find it on the scalp, I don't know if they're dead. Will it matter? I'm surprised the photo is able to capture the mark. Why do they all look like this? The father. He's not human. He's a jackal. There's no image for this? Oh, is that the image? There you go. Well, there's the... That's, that's it, then. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. Yeah. Dude, they showed that to us, that to us earlier. Didn't even know what it meant until now. Status healthy. So this one didn't die. Sir, there was another survivor. They must have kept it hidden away. It's probably one of the characters we've already seen. I, I don't think it would be her, right? It could be the other girl, her roommate. It's on... Yeah, so the hair would be covering it. Dude, imagine it's her. I don't... It couldn't be her because she wasn't even here. Look for the mark. On her head? Wait, so is it her? How did he know? Oh, fuck. He knew where it was. Because... Oh, he was pushing her hair back. It is her. Oh, sh... <laughs> Oh, this is cool, man. Yeah, he pushed her hair back in that scene. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Why'd she look at me? <laughs> what the hell? Is this going back to that night? Is she flying? What the fuck? And this is when she woke up? No, this is before that. Wait, this is, no, this is a different day. Wait, what? Oh my God, this all happened that night? What the fuck? Oh, we saw this scene in the beginning. We just didn't see who it was. What the fuck? Oh my God, it's gonna be the Jackal, isn't it? They want her to be the one to, oh no. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't like it. Oh, ah, what the fuck? Dude, the way they've been visualizing this jackal is fucking awesome. Is she gonna say she was, I don't know, cause well, what would they do about that? So is she, she's gonna be pregnant then, right? She's gotta be pregnant now with Damien, right? Is she gonna be the one to give birth to Damien? <laughs> Somebody say something. <laughs> That's not possible. She's been a ward of the church her entire life. They must have moved her around to cover their tracks. Carlita must be too young, so. That's what I was thinking. She was young, yeah. Oh my god, that's why they brought her here. Oh shit. To impregnate you with the fucking jackal. Don't touch me. Don't you touch And the vision she was having, dude, this is fucking great. Holy shit. This is one of those movies where I feel like as it goes along, I like it more and more. You know, I wasn't like crazy about it in the beginning. So that's pretty good. It's entertaining, but like it's getting really good now. I'm so sorry this is happening to you, my child. It's June 6th, midnight. They will be coming for you. Well, she's going to give birth to this baby, right? If I am pregnant, then I need it out of me. How are you going to do that? Go to the hospital? and I, I don't know. This doctor knows what he's doing. Let's hope so. Yes. Can we trust this driver? For some reason, I don't think we could trust this driver. You know, I know they said we could before, but I don't really believe it, to be honest. I'm kind of like sus suspicious of the driver. Wait, yeah. stop. What are you doing? Uh, don't stop. Make like you're heading for the main road and then turn off the body arch. Don't tell me she's going to give birth now. <laughs> I mean, because I don't know how this pregnancy works. It's probably accelerated, right? 
What is happening to me? I don't know. Oh! They're already coming after you. Holy shit. That killed the driver. Did that kill Gabriel too? I mean, we know Father Brennan's okay. Oh my god. She's given one hell of a performance. I don't know who the actress is, but she's killing it. What the fuck? What 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 is she doing? Oh my god. <laughs> oh like what the fuck? Looking like what the <laughs> Oh no, these are they're with the church, so Whoa! Whoa! Is she giving birth? Oh my god! Oh my god! What the fuck? They're gonna come collect the baby. Duh. Well, we know it's gonna work out like that because that's, I mean, this is a prequel, so we know, we know what's coming next. Oh my god. Hello? Hello? Can anyone hear me? Did she already give birth? Soon it will be all over, I promise. The baby you're about to bear will redeem the church. It's just gonna get a bunch of people killed. It's such an interesting mentality and motivation, but it's fucked up. It's terrible. <laughs> Do the parallels of her head, like lying back with her hair out like that to some other scenes in the movie where her hair looked just like that. That's really, really brilliant. Oh, yeah. They're cutting it out, aren't they? This, I guess it can't come out naturally. Uh. Oh, God. They're all watching. Even her. Oh. What the fuck? Oh. Oh. What is it, a boy or girl? It's going to be a boy, isn't it? That looks like a girl. Oh, there's two. One's a boy, one's a girl. A boy. Oh my god. They're going to kill the girl though, aren't they? <laughs> Is she gonna try to kill him? She's gonna try to stab the knife into it. Oh, she's gonna she's gonna try to do that. Yeah, I mean, I, it's the Antichrist. I mean, he's kind of like I get it, but it's still a baby. It's that's that's not gonna be easy to do. But she's she's gonna try to do it, isn't she? You are doing God's work. He would be so proud. I don't think he would be. Don't you hear his voice? No, I only hear my own. Oh, she stabbed him? <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Dude, that's that's oh shit. Oh shit. Stop this. If this actually is Damien, then she obviously isn't gonna do it, but and maybe it's not Damien, I don't know. Cause they could always get another, right? Oh, was it the roommate? Oh, what the fuck? And she does it with a she does it with a smile. 
Evil, man. Evil. Burn everything. Leave them both to die. Oh shit, Carlita. Maybe she could do something. Maybe not. I think she's dead. They left the girl baby down there, right? Well, she said let both of them burn. She was referring to Margaret and the girl baby. Holy shit. Ain't no way she's gonna live. Is she? Oh. Carlita came down here. What the fuck? That's the jackal. So is she gonna end up living? The man oh you were shit! For, the U.S. ambassador to Rome. Yeah, and they're the one that they give the baby he to. Will be the new father. <laughs> he and his wife will suffer a tragic oh, loss. This leads into it. Be in need of a child. Oh, this leads into the omen perfectly, dude. Soon, wow. his darkness will spread, <laughs> and the world shall be saved. I mean, that's one of the best. I mean, I, it's not over yet. I, I think it's almost over. But that, that's got to be one of the best horror prequels I've ever seen, to be honest. I'm glad she. Li I'm glad they lived, but um, I guess they're just living off in the wilderness now. Oh, and she's still raising the girl. Interesting. I wonder if this girl plays a role in like the other Omen sequels. Like I said, I haven't seen those. I've only seen the first Omen, but I, I probably should watch the other Omen movies then. Oh shit, he's here. I wonder if this is. Like after the events? No, it can't be right. No, it's probably right after. Oh shit! Oh. I'm so sorry, Margaret. I tried just to leave you be. You need to go. I came to warn you. They know you're alive. Oh shit! I just want to be left alone. I know, but they will come for you. Came all that way to warn her. I respect it. They've even given it a name. Damien. Damien. Wow. Easily one of the best horror prequels I have ever seen. Without a doubt. I gotta check to see uh, the Omen sequels. I'm not gonna like look too much into them just in case I decide to watch them someday. But I'm just, I just want to look up like the synopsis of Omen, uh, Omen, the Omen 2. See if it has anything to do with this girl. I don't know. Because, I mean, from my memory, the first Omen didn't... Or the original Omen. <laughs> I call it the first Omen. That's the name of this movie. But when I say it, when I say that, I'm talking about the original. Um, it didn't have anything to do with the sister. I don't think... Did we even learn about the sister in that one? I don't remember. But regardless, I... I love this movie. I think even standing on its own, like, even if you haven't seen the original, I feel like you could still understand what's going on and, and, and latch on to the story and be invested in what's going on and, and still understand all of it. But I think it played out really interestingly. And especially towards the end there, all that stuff was so good. Once we learned that she was, in fact, one of the, the kids um, with the, the 666 symbol, I don't know what you would call them necessarily, but you know, you know what I'm talking about. Once she learned that she was one of them, that twist there, that is when things just started getting absolutely insane. I was still liking the movie before that, but that is when things got absolutely insane. Her acting was just out of this fucking world. Really, really enjoyed that. And it just got darker and darker and grittier and, and just a lot of crazy shit going down. That's that's all I got to say about that. Uh, something about the the tension and the the way everything was shot, everything felt very anxiety inducing, but in like a good way. And it looked crisp all the way through as well. Like everything just looked good. It was obviously a well-made film. I didn't feel like there was any moments that they were slacking off in terms of that. So in terms of horror movies of this year, it's got to be up there as one of the better ones for sure. I, I would say at least top three from the ones I've seen. So definitely going to be checking out some more horror movies from this year, though, of course, because I want to, you know, expand my, my ranking as much as I can when we get to the end of the year. But De definitely glad I watched this. Definitely glad I, I finally got to it. If you want to see my reaction to the original Omen, definitely go check that out. Link will be in the description. If you want me to check out the other Omen movies, let me know that as well. Maybe I'll check them out on my own time. Depends on whether or not people care to see my reactions to them or not. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Don't forget to check out the full uncut reaction on my Patreon. Peace out, everyone.